My name is Father Ray Schroth, and I'm an associate editor here at America Magazine. Some years ago, I lived in New Orleans and was teaching at Loyola University. Um, I said Mass in the prison on a regular basis, and one day, on Sunday, I said Mass in the women's dormitory. All these women were stacked together in bunks that come together to hear this, uh, this prayer and this uh, Mass. And after Mass, a woman came up to me and she said, Father, I want you to do me a big favor, please, please, uh, go see my son. I said, sure, uh, uh, where does he live? And she said, he's here, he's downstairs. And I was, I, I was really overcome, I never forgot that. Uh, the utter abandonment and loneliness of mother and son in the same prison and uh, have not the opportunity to see and talk to one another. And that came back just last week when I saw this story about the Arizona prison system that was initiating a change unlike any prison system in the country where they were going to charge a initial uh, visitor fee. Right? And they say it's a background check fee of $25 to come and see the, the inmate. Now, they said it was to take care of the cost of that inspection they have to do to find out who you are if you're going to come and see somebody. But the real reason was they just want to get some money so they can paint the wall and uh, maintain the usual stuff of the prison. I think it's a bad idea for three reasons. One, visits are an essential part of the, uh, the attempt to rehabilitate a person by keeping his or her family in good contact with a relative who was locked away. And you say, well, $25, that's not a lot of money. To some people it is, especially after you travel a long distance, you might want to bring the children uh, as well. Second, for the prisoner and for the family, it's one more humiliation. That's another way to punish them. And they're punished enough. And third, it's the responsibility of the larger community, the state, the city, to maintain the prison system, which they feel is part of its future and a part of its security. Not to palm off the cost on the people who are already suffering enough from being part of this system. And finally, uh, it doesn't hurt to remember the 24th chapter of the Gospel of Matthew. If you recall that, Jesus is describing the last judgment. And he says, when I was in prison, you did not visit me. And he says, what do you mean I didn't visit you? Because I was the prisoner. When you visit a prisoner, you're, you're visiting Jesus Christ. But we should not get in the way of that process. Thank you very much.